All right, so Sign of the Beaver is about a beaver Mm-mm. holding a sign. No. It's not. No. There was a sign on a tree that meant beaver. A sign that meant beaver? Yeah. For the mean? beaver tribe. Oh, <laughs> so it's better no. than just a single beaver holding a sign. There's a whole tribe of beavers with signs. No, no. No, they're a tribe of Indians called the beaver tribe. What? <laughs> I feel ripped off. I know. Oh, well, that's a little disappointing. What is the book about? It's not about beavers. It's about this boy named Matt. He and his dad built a cabin for his family, so he had to stay and guard the cabin. From beavers? No. He has to, like, protect the cabin just so it doesn't blow up. So it doesn't blow up. <laughs> Why would it blow up? Beavers with dynamite. <laughs> met an Indian boy while he was there. They like did stuff together. And then they got attacked by a bear. Mm-hmm. And then they went fishing a lot. Wait a minute, you can't just move on from that. So they were um just wandering around in the woods and then they um heard a rustle in the um bush. And they thought it was a beaver. No. Dang it. It was a bear cub. It kinda of looks like a beaver. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yes. And then, like, they heard a big rustle, and it was the mom bear. A big beaver. <laughs> for for a book that's called Sign of the Beaver, I definitely want more beavers in this. Story. I know. Yeah. So let's just put them in there. What do you mean? So as you tell me the rest of the story, make it about beavers. That can be fun. <laughs> All right. So there was bears. Was there any other exciting parts about the book? He got attacked by bees and almost drowned. He wanted honey, so he climbed a bee tree, but then a giant swarm of bees attacked him, and he fell off the tree, and then he ran for the water, and then he almost drowned. So when you said he got attacked by bees, I really thought you were going to say beavers. <laughs> you tell me that story, except change it to beavers. Okay. He did. He did so much better. <laughs> he got attacked by beavers, and then he climbed a tree, and he wanted honey. <laughs> from the beaver hive and then a swarm of beavers attacked him so he went for the water which that's not a good idea I know if you're being chased by bees it might be okay to hide in the water but if you're chased by a swarm of beavers the water is the last place you want to be <laughs> did he become a man what a lot of times in these books you start out as a young boy and by the time you've faced all of these challenges you've become a man well i guess he was kind of more of a man or was he more of a beaver that would be awesome if he did let's change it up nobody's read this book how do you know mom said it was a really famous book no we'll just tell him that it's about a boy who turns into a beaver (laughs) yeah 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 he, he's a superhero who can turn into a beaver. And, and the symbol on his chest is the sign of the beaver. <laughs> yeah. Sounds like a book that would win a Newbery. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 <I'm> so <laughs> dumb. <laughs>